Hi guys, this is Igor Saavedra. Check out my interviews and a lot of great interviews at for bass players only. Igor Saavedra. Hi John. How are you my friend? I'm doing great man. It is good to see you again. It's been a long time. It's been, I don't know, a little while since we did uh, your first interview on our website for BassPlayersOnly.com. 2012. Okay, well that was a while ago. A couple of, yeah. So you are a busy guy, you've been doing a lot of things. Bring us up to date. What have you been doing since then? Well, we're in 2014, so this is a, has been an amazing year for me. Yeah, I would say. Many, many places I can mention, for example, well, NAM, Winter NAM, many duties in there. Uh, we met there, we saw each other in there. Always. Uh, I, what else I can add? Well, I've been playing in Colombia. Many gigs, very nice, very nice. I've played there several times. Yeah, man, it's amazing. Uh, also, well, uh, Detroit Bass Festival. I mean, it's. Uh, oh, I'm recording my first, my debut solo album in Germany too, in another city. Well, tell us about that. Yeah, that's 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 an important thing for me. It's my first album after many years of playing. I delayed it on purpose. Now I think I feel pre prepared for that. It's. Uh, it's, I think now it's a good moment. I, you know, I started very old. I started at 22 with music from zero. So my, my process has been different. Now I think I can do it. And it's going to be an album. It, it being, it's being done in a HD video. If I will play by myself, just by myself. No, uh, no sequences, no uh, loops, nothing. Just me and chord melody stuff. I will mix South American and uh, see, South American mostly rhythms, music. Original with, music? Yeah, with All my, original. Yeah, South American rhythms, I mean the, the styles, but uh, it's my music. It's uh, not all original, I will do a couple covers that I like, to that represent me very well. Uh, I will be there, but it, it, it will be mostly that. Very simple, very, very organic and uh, I'm looking forward to that. Well, so are we. You be sure to keep us posted on that. I will, definitely. Now, I mean, we all know you are a great bass player. Oh, thank you. But you are not just an ordinary bass player. You play some pretty exotic instruments, particularly your eight-string bass. I know we talked about that last time, but uh, tell us a little more about the instrument that you play, your main instrument. Well, my, ma my main instrument, I would say my only instrument, I've been playing eight-string basses exclusively. Many people say I'm like the pioneer of X-string bass. Perhaps it's true in the sense that uh, perhaps before me in 1999 there were some some X-string basses, but nobody dedicated their lives to this X-string bass. Now somewhere in the middle of those eight strings is E A D G. Yes, and you've got it is exactly that. <laughs> some below and some above. Right in the middle, we have the fourth string, and you add two more: the C and the F for the height register. I'm going low, the B, which everybody knows, yeah. and the F sharp, okay. killing, sounding great. And I use Pratt Basses, which is my, my sponsor, and uh, that's it. I mean, very, very, very nice instrument. No knobs, which is my, my um, signature thing. I don't use any volume, tone, or anything. I don't use preamps. I don't use, that's my volume control and <laughs> my tone control, and that's it. This is very, very uh, something that uh, uh, takes a lot of my my interest getting the sound with them hands it's it's very interesting yeah well you've got great hands <laughs> as Thank evidenced you. by your great music uh, you've got a great instrument too and tell us about the strings that you use you use labella right I use labella exclusively I mean I've been with these guys for many years and and these guys have been really nice with me all the way I've been playing for some they invited me all the way from Chile for the lots of the low end in New York that was last year, and uh, it was a fantastic show, very, very nice show. And then they invited me to the company, to the factory, so I, 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 I went, I saw the process, it's pretty outstanding, and now they are launching very soon the, the whole ERV, extended range basis line, going from 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12 string basses under my name so uh, it's so flattering and and uh, it's gonna be released quite soon on the website well tell us about the strings themselves why do you like them so much well i think lavella is is completely committed i mean what 
what can I say, to string making. They, they manufacture so many strings for everything, for many brands, for many instruments. They are so, so uh, uh, committed with the production of strings. It was really outstanding when I was at the factory. And uh, the strings they make, for example, the stainless steel strings I use, they do it in hexacore, uh, the, the coil, and uh, they uh, also, uh, what, what I saw is that the process is so meticulous, so, 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 uh, that, that word exists in English, yeah? Yes. Metic okay, okay. I do the fast translation out of Spanish, but I think it, it was a word. Meticulous. So, also. Yeah. <laughs> so, I was very impressed. The, the strings are high quality, they are not expensive. Uh, guys like Alain Caron use that string. Uh, if Alain Caron use that strings, man, I mean, I know Brad uh, don't, don't take my word, take Alain's, you see? <laughs> well, we'll take Alain's and we'll take your word also. Ooh, well. So what about the future? What else is in store for Igor Savendra? Oh, there's a very interesting project coming, sponsored by, the, by a car manufacturer. I, and I keep the car. That's, that's so awesome. <laughs> so Can I will, you tell us which car? Maybe? No, I can't yet. But uh, it will be a tour that I will be doing in South America. Uh, with the car, of course, and uh, I w it's, it'll be amazing because I will be able to to move very shortly from places and, and do some little concerts and some little clinics and workshops. So it does have something to do with music. It, it's absolutely okay. It, it, I, my my new album is going to be released exactly on that moment, so it's uh, it, it will everything will fit. I will be carrying a bunch of albums with me hey, hey, selling you know yes. <laughs> so it'll be it'll be great man. all right well we look forward to the new album and uh lots more touring and uh no matter where you are whoever's watching this uh, chances are igor will be somewhere not too far from you in the not too distant future because you are uh, right the world traveler oh thank you john coming from you every compliment coming from you for me is big man so uh, i really appreciate your attention I, I hope to deserve it and uh, the fact that you are, you are, we are here together in Detroit and uh, we will be in, in Germany and we always meet, so it's such a fun. Well, huh? thank you very much. It is mutual. Igor Saavedra, thanks very much. Keep doing what you're doing. Much luck and continued success to you always. Thanks. Bye, John. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.